Good day, YouTube. And it's actually not a bad movie. You sir are stupid. That, however, is. You haven't seen it. You're lying. It's still anyway, <laughs> nobody wants to look at the anal bead-tailed rat instead of me. I hope. Anyway, today we are doing another version of the Laker Challenge. This is Laker Strong versus. <laughs> it's upside down too. So, Laker Strong versus Lakeport Strong. Lakeport Strong not available anymore. This bottle, who knows how old it is now, but um, <laughs> so we're gonna compare the two. Yeah, I remember the Lakeport Strong was actually like fairly all right out of the Lakeport. Yeah. So here we have the two of them side by side. Right away, you see a difference in alcohol percentage. Six point five for the Laker, five nine for the Lakeport. Laker brewed by the Brick. Lakeport brewed by Labatt. No. So right there, I'm putting two points towards Laker. <laughs> Holy shit! Twist off that does not open. Okay, one point for Lakeport. <laughs> <laughs> so, on the left we will have. Oh fuck! I thought this was supposed to be a blind taste test. Yeah, you fucked it up already, boy. Who cares? Well, technically, he is blind, so. <laughs> I'm just making it a side by side. It's okay. Side by each? Yeah. Retard. Paul's is all foam, so he's sort of one already. This foam will die down. Just talks about the very low quality of the beer. you want it more? Not really. Oh, I totally heard you. Okay. So the left is the Laker. The right shall be the Lake Port. <coughs> it literally looks like piss. Mine still has foam in it. Another one more. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Seriously, people, stop it. <laughs> stop putting your finger in and killing the foam. Alrighty, so. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you, you wanted more foam. There we go. So we have the two strongs. <laughs> you know, whatever's on the left smells, smells like, like shit. shit. <laughs> it does, but the lake port actually smells better, I think. Marginally. Especially out of, the right, out of the bottles, you can... Whatever's on the right smells better. That's the lake port. That's the lake port, yep. that's what we're saying. Yeah. So now it's two and two. Color-wise, Paul has no, uh... Paul Stop has it. no foam. <laughs> Paul has no foam, they look the exact same. <laughs> yeah. Exact same, basically. Actually, that one's a slight. Actually, the light port's actually a slight tinge lighter. Yeah, really? actually, actually, yeah. whatever's on the, on the left is clear. It's a little darker. Yeah. Alrighty, well, let's try them. Why? We know their shit. Oh, that's gross. That's it's like terrible. sugary corn barf. The Laker. We've had the Laker strong before. We said we didn't like it. It is 6.5% oh, alcohol. Someone farted in my mouth. Yep. 6.5% <laughs> alcohol. But at the same time, it is a budget beer. Yeah, budget. That'll get you. That'll get you drunk. That's the only reason to buy this. It does not taste good whatsoever. How about Luckily, the Laker? I'm not a crackhead. The Laker, a lot sweeter. Where the lake port is, uh... A lot more garbage here. Yeah. But out of the two, which would you rather drink? If these were the last two beers on Earth, probably the lake port. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, um, I never thought I'd say that, because I'm, I hate Labatt so much. Yeah. But 
really, Lake Port is probably the one I'd go with. Yep. The only reason I'd choose Laker <laughs> is the 0.6% alcohol more. Hmm. But I am not a crackhead, so I don't need to get drunk off cheap-ass beer, no. so... The Lake Port has the least aftertaste, I would say. Yes, it's it's actually almost dry. And that's why I would choose it, because they both taste like shit. There you guys go, from three people. The Lake Port Strong, which unfortunately is not available any longer, is the better. Burn! <laughs> Where the Laker Strong, oh, which damn. was my shitty available, beer on the market, is horrible still. Thank I you guess guys. I'll have to go back to PBR. Bye. <laughs>